Intel Next General Panther Lake configurations revealed, up to 16 CPU and 12 3 Celestial GPU cores. The core configurations of Intel's next-gen Panther Lake CPUs have been revealed in a new core boot patch which shows up to 16 cores. Intel Panther Lake CPUs feature up to 16 CPU cores and 12 3 GPU cores for mobile platforms Intel's next-gen Panther Lake CPUs will be the follow-up to the Arrow Lake and Lunar Lake Core Ultra 200 inches lineup which will make its first debut in the coming months. The upcoming CPUs will be utilizing three brand new architectures, the Lion Cove Peak cores, Sky Monte cores, and Stu Graphics cores. The Panther Lake CPUs will debut as the Core Ultra 300 inches lineup and are planned for a 2H 2025 release. We know a few bits and pieces about Panther Lake so far but it looks like more information on the specific configurations has been revealed in a core boot patch which details four different Panther Lake SKUs. It is known that Panther Lake CPUs will leverage Cougar Cove P cores and Sky Monte cores through the Sky Monte cores featured on Panther Lake will be an optimization or even an update so it is highly likely that we will see the naming of the e-cores change close to the debut of the chips. On the GPU side, Intel's Panther Lake CPUs will feature the third major's architecture update in the form of 3 which is codenamed Celestial and will be the direct follow-up to 2 Battle Mage architecture. Intel's 2 architecture will make its first debut on the Lunar Lake OCS while discrete products are expected to launch later this year. So coming to the SKUs, there are 4 chips mentioned in Panther Lake H and Panther Lake Q flavors. These include the following, PTLH SKU No. 1, 4 P cores plus 8 E cores plus 0 L P E cores plus 4 3 cores, 45 watts. PTLH SKU No. 2, 4 P cores plus 8 E cores plus 4 L P E cores plus 12 3 cores, 25 watts. PTLH SKU No. 3, 4 P cores plus 8 E cores plus 4 L P E cores plus 4 3 cores. 25 watts. PTL USKU number 1, 4 P cores plus 0 E cores plus 4 L P E cores plus 4 3 cores, 15 watts. The Intel Panther Lake HCPUs will be configured in 25 to 45 watts DDPs and feature a mix of 16 and 12 core variants. The 45 watts chip is a 12 core part, 4 P plus 8 E and features just 4 3 cores while the other two SKUs incorporate 16 cores, 4P plus 8E plus 4 LP, and come in 12 3 and 4 3 variants. Both SKUs are set at a TDP of 25 watts. Lastly, there's the Panther Lake QSKU which features an 8 core configuration with 4P and 4E cores and 4 3 cores while being rated at a TDP of 15 watts. Currently, Meteor Lake CPUs come in a maximum of 6P cores, 8T cores, and 2 LPE cores so it looks like Intel is cutting 2P cores in favor of 2 extra LPE cores. Lunar Lake CPUs also come with 4 LPE cores as the company noted that these are a lot more efficient for mobile tasks and Skymont is bringing a big IPC benefit to the table too. Previously. Jake had posted the power ratings for various Intel Panther Lake mobile SKUs which feature similar configurations as the one leaked through Core Boot. These CPUs will feature max PL2 ratings of 80 watts, 45 watts P. L1, 64 watts, 28 watts PL1, and 54 watts, 15 watts PL1. Things are looking good for Intel Panther Lake CPUs as the configurations have already been panned out and according to Intel itself, the chips are on track for production in the first half of 2025 while showing good health. There are also reports that Panther Lake won't be coming to desktops with an Arrow Lake refresh lineup being the contender for next year's desktop launch which will be followed by Nova Lake in 2026.